Hi everyone, this is Emmy. Today I'm going to show you how to crochet this super easy slouchy hat. So let's get started. To make this easy beanie hat, I'm going to work with two strands of worsted weight yarn and a 9mm crochet hook. If you prefer not to use two strands of yarn, you can use a bulky yarn such as this or even a chenille yarn. I'm going to work bottom up. You're going to start with a slip knot and you're going to make a chain that will wrap around the head and here are the number of chain stitches for each size. Okay, my chain will wrap around the head. Now I'm going to slip stitch to join, being careful not to twist the chain. Slip stitch to join. Now I'm going to chain one. And that takes the place of this first stitch. And I'm going to single crochet in each stitch all the way around single crochet for single crochet insert the hook into the stitch pick up the yarn and pull it through pick up the yarn th pull it through both loops I'm going to go ahead and single crochet all the way around so single crochet in each stitch all the way around okay I worked all the way around at the end of the row, I'm going to slip stitch to join in that first stitch. And again, for this row, you need to be careful not to twist that first row of stitches. So now I'm going to pull in another color. I'm going to pull in black. So pull the yarn through that stitch, lock it in. And that will take the place of the first single crochet. So I'm going to single crochet in each stitch all the way around. Okay, all the way around. Okay, I worked all the way around at the end of the row. I'm going to slip stitch to join and fasten off. And I left my other yarn connected and I'm just going to pull that up in that last stitch. And I'm going to chain two and I'm going to double crochet in each stitch all the way around. To make a double crochet, yarn around the hook, insert into the stitch, pick up the yarn and pull it through. Pick up the yarn, pull it through two loops, pick up the yarn, pull it through two loops. So I'm going to go all the way around, making one double crochet in each stitch. All the way around. Okay, I worked all the way around. At the end of the row, slip stitch to join in the top of the chain two. Chain two. And that will take the place of the first stitch. Front post double crochet around the next stitch. To make a front post double crochet, yarn around the hook, insert the hook under the post from the front of the double crochet, and complete the double crochet. Double crochet in the next stitch. Front post double crochet in the next stitch. Double crochet in the next. And you're going to repeat all the way around. Okay, after working all the way around, slip stitch to join in the top of the chain two. Now the next row will be a regular double crochet row. So chain two, double crochet in each stitch all the way around. like that. So you have one row of double crochet and one row of front post and then double in the next stitch. So you're going to repeat that for as many rows as required. Okay, so I have a row of single crochet, single crochet, then I have regular double crochet, front post double crochet, regular double crochet, front post, regular and front post. So, so now I'm going to start decreasing for the top of the hat. So chain one, single crochet, single crochet, single crochet, skip the next stitch, go directly into the next, single crochet, single crochet, single crochet, skip, go right to the next. Continue working in a spiral until the top of the hat is closed. Okay, I worked around and around in a spiral and work until probably an inch and a half and then fasten off 
thread the yarn end into a needle, weave through this last row of stitches, like that, and then just sew that hole closed. And weave the yarn end into the finished work. And there you have the basic hat. And that's the basic hat. Click the link below in the description and in the pinned comment if you'd like to learn how to crochet a pom-pom. And here it is with a crocheted pom-pom and with a faux fur pom-pom. Click the link below if you want to find out how to make these faux fur pom-poms. And I also put a link below on how to make these easy flowers. And you can make these out of scraps of fabric or with an old t-shirt or scarf or blouse. Or if you'd like to attach a shawl pin, I put a link below on how to make your own shawl pins. So that's it. That's how easy it is to make this crochet slouchy beanie. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.